hey guys back with another video for my addictive blogging channel so in this video i will be talking about the gestures in this msfg test to mini and now you can take screenshots and also turn on the flashlight of your phone via the gestures of the smartwatch yes this is possible now and it is only available in the costly smartwatches like the samsung galaxy watch 4 and the apple watch 7 series smartwatches so we will see how we can do that and also how effective is those gestures in this smartwatch so as always this video will be a sick video guys and if you are taking to see as to don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and hit that bell notification up because i will be making more videos like this so let's start so i have the msvg test to mini with me and we will see how we can activate the gestures to turn on the flashlight and also to take screenshots in our phone so first of all to do that you need to download the notify app which is the third party app for the amazfit watches and make sure you have connected your smartwatch which is the amazfit gts to mini with the notify app so once you have done that you also need to download the zap app which is the official app and also here you need to make sure the watch is connected and the battery percentage should be showing in the top left corner here so once these things are completed you need to come to the notify app and once you are in the notify app you will be getting the option of gestures in the last icon so just click on here and you have to come to button options and in here in the settings you need to make sure you have turned on the performance mode here once you have turned on the performance mode you have to come to the button option again and here you need to select the custom actions option and once you are in the custom action you need to come to lift actions so this is the option to enable the gestures in the smartwatch so here you need to just enable the option and there are a lot of things you can do but, but taking screenshot is not there in this list so we have to do something different in here so we will bind the action to the tasker app so we have to first install any of the tasker app for our msv gts2 mini to work so any of the tasker app will be okay i have already installed the tasker app which is available in the play store so if you come to play store you will be getting the option to download the tasker app in here and if you see the tasker app will be there directly in the play store you just need to download it or you can download another app which is the automate app which is also another tasker app so any of the app is okay both of the apps support the task actions in the notify app so once you have downloaded any of the app you just need to click on button and go to custom action and here under lift action you need to select task action and once you have done that you need to come to the task app whichever task app you have downloaded so i have downloaded the task app here and in here you need to create a new task once you just click on this plus symbol and create a new task you will be prompted with this here you need to select the event and in event you need to come to system and in here you need to click on intent received option so in intent receive you need to give the intent which will be transferred from notify app to the task app so for task action intent code we need to come to the notify app again and in here we need to select the custom action option so in the button actions option if you go to tasker help you will be getting the code which is required to be given in the tasker app so for lift event use you need to just copy this intent code so once you have copied the intent code in here you need to come to the tasker app and in the tasker app you need to just click on this plus sign and once you click on this plus sign you will be getting the option to create and click on create and you will get the option of event here and in the event you have to come to system and then you have to come to intent received here you need to just paste the code which we have copied and once you have done that you just need to click on this back button and once you have clicked on this back button you will be getting the option of new task and in new task just click on this tick sign and you will be getting the option of adding new task once you got the option you just need to click on this plus sign and in here you can select a bunch of things so i will be selecting the flashlight feature you can just search here flashlight 
and you will be getting the option of flash and torch just click on this torch option and here in the set click on toggle and you are good to go so once you have done that you just need to click on the stick sign and it is set to start the task action so here once you have done all this you just need to make sure the lift action is activated and once you have done that you just need to lift this watch and you can see the torch has been turned on so again if i lift the torch will be disabled so you can see the torch is disabled so i am just keeping my phone like this to show you guys whether it is working or not so i just lift it you can see the torch is glowing now and again i will lift it the torch is off right now so turning on the flashlight is working fine so now let's see how we can take screenshots also so for that you just need to come to tasker app and in the task you just need to click and hold this torch toggle and in here just select different task and in the different task click on new task and once you have clicked on new task you will be getting this tick sign and again you have to click on this plus symbol and here you just search for screenshot so for taking screenshot you will be getting a lot of options you need to select take screenshot and once you have selected you just need to click on cancel and in here you just need to give a name of the screenshot you can give any name so i am just giving screenshot and insert in gallery just stick it on and once you have done that you just need to click on back and once you have clicked on back you are set to take screenshot via the gestures in ms with gts 2 mini you just need to lift your watch like this and you will see some prompt you just need to click on that and this screenshot has been taken and saved into gallery right now so you can see if i come to gallery this screenshot has been taken and this is working fine so if you don't want the prompt to be coming while taking screenshot like this screen recording so you can do one thing for that you just need to install one of the app which is the tasker permission app and just run some command from the pc so this will eliminate the prompt from the tasker app and also due to android 12 limitations this prompt will be coming while you will be taking this screenshot from this watch so that's it guys i just wanted to show you how you can do certain actions via the gestures in the msv gts2 mini and it is really really simple guys you just need to configure the tasker app according to the action you want to do so i hope you have liked this video if you like this video don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and hit that bell notification up because i will be making more videos like this so thank you guys have a great day thank you